I'm Brittany McGraw and this is your 10 News Update. Virginia Tech researchers are going underground to track COVID-19 on campus. They're testing wastewater every day, mostly from residence halls, to get a snapshot shot of what's happening in a population without having to test every student. With the sewage surveillance, they're able to detect the virus before someone has symptoms. Appalachian Power is requesting reduction in the fuel rate for its Virginia customers. The company is looking to lower the rate about 0.3 cents. This is due to the drop in natural gas costs. The drop doesn't sound like much, but it would save customers $3 per thousand kilowatts per month. If approved, the reduction will go into effect in November. The race for the largest congressional district in Virginia is heating up with a focus on an issue dividing the country. On Tuesday, Republican 5th District candidate Bob Good hosted local rallies supporting law enforcement. He says if elected, he wants to find new ways to support officers. Good claims his opponent wants to defund the police, which is something Democrat Cameron Webb denies. A reminder that you can get updates on the go with WSLS.com and the 10 News app. I'm Brittany McGraw, 10 News, working for you.